Hello everyone, Casual War here, and I'm making this video to show you guys a glitch in the Generation 4 games which can be abused to give yourself a 1 in 32% chance to find shiny Pokemon randomly in the wild. Um, this glitch uses Cute Charm, and pretty much the way these games force the opposite gender is well first um let me tell you some other parts before I get into that whenever you encounter a wild Pokemon the game generates this random number for the Pokemon which determines its gender its ability its nature and if it could be shiny or not depending on your own ID number um, yeah, so, usually when you find, find a Pokemon, um, it has this randomized number, and, you know, it has, it gets its ability and stuff like that from that, but, for some reason, in Generation 4 games, when Cute Charm is activated, which is 66% of the time, it will force the opposite gender, and when it does that, instead of just, like, you know, having a randomized number, like, keep randomizing the number until the correct gender is found, it actually just, just sets the, the random number, it sets it to a static number to force the gender. And then, after that, it increases it by a specific amount to give it, um a nature, a randomized nature. So what it does is instead of the randomized number being anywhere between zero and like four billion plus, it's um, between zero and twenty-five. Or between like um, fifty and seventy-five or two hundred and two twenty-five. Because it's all based on the nature or all based off the gender, I mean, and the gender ratio. I'm using a male cute charmer. It's a Cletha, and it's passed out, so that's why you don't see it in battle. But it is in my lead spot, so the cute charm ability is still in effect for some reason. I don't know why, but I guess that's another glitch in the game. How the ability is still in effect and the Pokemon is passed out. Um, I guess it's the same way how you can use HM even though the Pokemon are passed out, but anyways. Um Yeah. So um for the male po so a male cute charmer will force females to appear sixty six percent of the time. So when it does that, it just sets the randomized number to be zero. And then it will add the nature number to that. So it'll be between zero and twenty-five. So that means you can have an ID number to make it where 0 to 7 will be shiny Pokemon, 8 to like 16 would be shiny Pokemon, and then like 17 or 19 to like 24 would be shiny, or then there's the one that's like just number 25, which is like, I think it's um, quirky nature, but yeah, so... You can, so you pretty much, you have a, you make yourself get this, um, specific ID number, you RNG abuse it, which I did for both of these games, I restarted my heart gold and my platinum, and I got those ID numbers on here, so what that did is make it where eight of the natures that are assigned to the zero PID, will be shiny so whenever cute charm is activated I have a 8 out of 25 percent chance of finding a shiny Pokemon and I think the total of that including the percentage of finding or cute charm activating is 1 out of 32 so that is a pretty high percentage of finding a shiny Pokemon as you can see through this video, I encountered multiple multiple shinies. Um, so yeah, that is um, pretty crazy glitch there. 
just um I'll probably have some links in the description for more details about this and how you could possibly get this on to happen on your game.